Hey guys, welcome to another video episode of Shout Me Loud. And this video is an extension of the few videos and content that I've done before. So if you remember, I talked about one very interesting trick using Brave Publisher program to make money. If you have not gone through that, and if you have a blog or YouTube channel, you should definitely check out this blog post. It will show you the exact method that you can use to make money from Brave Publisher program. Brave is a you know web browser just like Chrome, very popular, something that you would like to know and make money from that. Now, one of the thing that, you know, in that video I talked about how, you know, you earn the BAT token and how it is transferred to Uphold, which is an exchange. And now the thing is, how can you transfer that money from Uphold to a crypto exchange and convert that into real money in your bank account. So this this exchange that I'm going to use, it's only from India. But if you're from any other country and want me to do a video for that, feel free to let me know and I will definitely do a video for you. Now, here's the thing. So, so far you can see I have earned 13,240 INR, which is roughly $200 in USD. Um, and you can see like everything which I've earned in BAT token is converted into Bitcoin already. So what I need to do is I need to transfer this coin to my exchange in India or if you are in any other country, you can transfer there. So there are many, many good exchange like CEX, CoinMama, Bitpanda. Bitpanda is very popular in Europe. CEX is popular in US. So you can use that to withdraw money in your country. Now, in this case, I'm transferring money to an Indian exchange. And I'm also going to show you how to sell those coin and withdraw that money. It's going to be a little lengthy, but even if you don't have Brave Publisher program, do watch. You will learn something new in this video and you're going to love that. So let's get started. All right, so I'm in the Apple dashboard. Now, what I need to do is I need to log into my exchange account. Now, this is BitBNS, which is very popular exchange in India. And here you can see, like, I already have about 1.22 Bitcoin. And I need to click on Receive. So this is the Bitcoin address, which is corresponding to my account. So you definitely need, need to ensure that you're logged into your BitBNS account. If you don't have an account, you can sign up for an account. I will leave the link in the description below. So now go to Uphold. Click on BTC card. Now here there are many options. Now select the send to cryptocurrency or utility token. Click on that. Select a cryptocurrency to send funds to. So I am selecting Bitcoin. And here I just pasted my Bitcoin address which I got from BitBNS over here. And I'll select use all available fund from this account. Um, this is a message just for my reference. And you can see the network fees is 0.002 and that's the reason in the earlier video i told you to transfer money when you really need it because you know you know you don't want to end up paying money and there is a withdrawal fees as well which is not much but still if you're earning you know small amount then you if you're paying network fees and withdrawal fees every time you do the transfer it just add a lot of you know you kind of lose all a lot of money so you know it's best if you can accumulate for three four months or more and when the time is right, when the Bitcoin price is high, when you feel like it's the right time to sell, then transfer this fund to your exchange and then sell it off. All right, so now just click on confirm. All right, so I need to give my Authy app. Let me just get my app. All right, so four, five, one, three, eight. All right, so I've just confirmed the value was sent successfully. I can go to blockchain.com BDC address paste my Bitcoin address anyways like it will take few minutes uh, for this transaction to complete and once that's done you will receive Bitcoin in your exchange now in this case I want to sell off the Bitcoin now the price is a little low but you know what I can do uh, so this is how the in interface for BitBNS looks like the mobile app is much easier to use so that's what I recommend and what I need to do is like just let's say I want to sell 0.02 Bitcoin. The price is four, but I'm not happy with the price. So I want to set it like when the price reaches this, the Bitcoin will be sold. And then I click on sell. Yes, confirm sale order. And that's it. So, you know, like that's how you sell the coin. But in this case, I'm not selling it off. I can click on wallet and 
and then i can withdraw the money like so in india the if you know like you cannot withdraw money directly so this exchange is allow you to withdraw fund using p2p method which is kind of neat but you have to be careful ensure that your bank does not know that you are doing crypto withdrawal i have not done any crypto withdrawal after the you know crypto is banned uh, since i don't have much money there but you know it's a good to know thing and you can definitely use exchanges from outside india to keep playing with the crypto if that's something you like doing and yes so that's how you withdraw fund from a pool to your to an exchange and then convert into your currency and then get money well i hope this money oh god i hope this video helped you to learn something new if you have any question feel free to ask me in the comment section below i will see you in the next video bye bye this is harsh